Yeah, what's good, buddy? Quay Mexican Quay, hell of a boss, dropped about two or three days ago. Uh, I was on a little trip. I didn't really have too much time to get into it, but we're going to be getting into it today. Season two, this is a brand new season, so I expect this to be fire like it usually is. Also, I see my little boo stole this in the thumbnail, so it's going to automatically be a W. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it. You do, you already know what to do. Come on out. House look good. Where's that? Yay, is that young stars? Calm yourself, young prince. You I know think it is. is unbecoming of a Goisha. Oh, right. But father told me today is the day I am old enough to know my purpose and responsibility. Of course, <laughs> I'm sure it will be wonderful. Oh. Oh. Hey, he look. Uh, which son is this one? There are so fucking many. Stolas, your highness. Stolas, yes. What? This man talking about which one? Man, he one of those. <laughs> Holy. Right, <laughs> that's the one. The old boy. Man, well, said which one? My little one, it is finally your day of becoming a true part of the Goisha family. How good for you. Are you ready to know what you will be meant to do to serve hell? Yes, father. You will be entrusted with the study of the Earth's skies, the stars, the prophecies they hold, all that stuff. Isn't that fun? You will begin the studies of your grimoire, which will grant you access to the mortal realm to study and observe, and you will grow to be a mighty prince of hell with your own legions to Dang, lead and pass on your knowledge to. You got a lot to do. I will do my best, father. Wonderful. Also, son, you are destined to sire a precautionary addition to the Goisha family, so you are now engaged. Congratulations. Isn't she charming? Nah. Oh, Heck no. Nah. son. Here, how about you cease this bitch crying? <laughs> that works. Oh, would you like it if I took you to the circus in town? Children enjoy the circus, right? Would that distract you enough from your non-negotiable future marriage? <laughs> nah, I'm not going for the marriage. Hell no. Nah. Is there a spot that is close to the front, but also far enough that I don't have to uh, smell the poor? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, the dad really is something else. Wait, why ain't he come to the circus? Yeah, he ain't like none of this. That's uh oh my god, I can't think of the name. That's y'all know who yeah, it's him. It's him. Can't think of the name. Y'all know who it is. <laughs> hey you folks, wanna see me make a horse? Crap. <laughs> it can't make no balloon and him save his life. Nah, give up, it's over. They like man, boo. Uh, horns. <laughs> well, <laughs> it was a horse, but then it ate too much sugar and its legs stopped working, so it had to amputate. Now it's a gross worm horse. <laughs> See, he gets it. This horses, they make no sense. Okay, I'm making up as they go. That's enough horsing around. Hey everybody, look at this! It's banana pudding the clown horsey! <laughs> Dang, I just stole the sun! Stroke. It was funny. Their legs do stop working when they eat too much sugar. It's called laminitis. <laughs> and then that's the clown. A show! <laughs> that was... Real great. So, uh, <clears throat> that little clown that you have, my son really enjoyed that one. I was wondering if I could buy him. 
buy him? Purchase him. Yes, accurate. Like a slave? My son doesn't have any friends, you see, and he liked the little clown boy. It's his birthday. He's so sad, and I don't want to deal with him. Can I write a check? Well, Fizzarelli is a big draw. He has a few more shows to be in today, so it would be pretty expensive. <laughs> no, no. The other one. Blitzow? Correct. That's what it uh, Well, he's my son, so... Uh, mm, uh, how much you got in your pocket? A uh, wadded up five in a slim fit condom. Yeah, that's plenty. <laughs> <laughs> Fetch him for me and we will be on our way. Dang, he only worth five in a, in a, in a bunched up condom? That's crazy. Me personally, I just wouldn't take the disrespect, man. I think if somebody wanted to buy my son, my seed, right? My, my offspring. Shoot, I'd probably sell him for 20 bucks if I needed it that bad. Nah, five dollars is crazy though. And I like the dance. I am warm horse. No, I, I am sad. Why are you sad, warm horse? Because I have no legs. Oh, well that's okay. I lost my legs in the war. <laughs> the war? Yes. The great pirate war. <laughs> no. No pirates. The great pirate war. Oh no. Punch you. I fought bravely, but I could not run fast enough. They took my legs. There was blood everywhere. <laughs> oh no, ew, no blood. Blood is disgusting. No, it's cool. <laughs> well, Banana Pudding is here to save the day. With his magical feet, he dances around with. He will dance all over Warm Horse and make him feel better. And then. There'll be more blood! What's so? up? That's so gross. Stop. <laughs> nah, he kind of had the same, but let's look at that. You're going to spend the day with one of the Goisha princes. Ew. Why? Because money. Now listen carefully. For five bucks. You will be out to be his playmate. But I want you to steal as much from those rich fuckers as you possibly can. Steal? But... But if I get caught? Don't you want your family to be able to buy a bigger tent? Better yeah. Food? Don't you want to be able to help me and your mama out? Of course I want to help mama. Then you gotta do this. Everything those Where is fucks have will be worth a fortune. But if I'm caught, I'm scared, Dad. There are scarier things, aren't there, son? But... <laughs> Hanging with yes. the googly eyes. So it's, it, I don't know, it's interesting to see that them as kids, they're they're actually nice. They're they're actually like, bro, they don't want to do nothing really that bad for real, for real. But I kind of want to know what what made them change to like when they're adults. Here is a new friend, my son. A happy birthday. So this is where the love start. Hi, uh, I'm Bledsoe. I'm Stoneless. It's nice. Ouch. Don't bow to that one. He bows to us, idiot. Oh, right. Sorry, father. I'm so good at daddying. <laughs> nah, <laughs> terrible. This is my book on the difference between frogs and toads. There's a lot of differences. And this is my book on plants and herbs. Did you know plants can hear you? Bro. They're boring. Bro, this bored is out his boring mind. stuff. Oh, I'm sorry. I've... Never had a friend to share my books with. You know it would be fun. A game. Let's play. Treasure hunt. What's that? It's where we pretend we are pirates. And we go around the house collecting all of the nicest things. And then we throw them out the window. We throw them out the window. Right, yes. right, right, right. Since when did pirates throw things out windows? Since right like now. the dawn of time. Come on, pirates are always throwing stuff out windows. I don't think they had windows. What, did your book say that? Yes, actually, several. Well, in this game, <laughs> we're throwing them out the window because it's fun. Well, that's an odd game. <gasps> Is this an imp game? Sure. Well, something like that, well, yeah. It's what like you that. want to play. Let's do it. <laughs> so this is where it all started. Come on, come on, come on. Man, that is a lot of good stuff. God damn. Damn. 
Damn. Man, there's a lot of stuff to be st stealing. Bro, he cleaned out the whole shelf. Steal that too? I want to say. Oh no, he did steal it. Bet you he gonna run off with the, the treasure. So what is that? Your diary? No, this is my new grimoire. It's a spell book. I have to learn it so that I can access the living world. The living world? Like the one with humans and stuff? Where the sinners come from? Mm-hmm. That's cool. Yes. I'm supposed to learn to use it to study the sky. Why? My dad says I can find prophecies, but... I don't really know, but I'm supposed to. That's what my job will be when I grow up, to join the rest of the Goetia family. Well, yeah. you know what I'm going to do when I grow up? I'm going to run my own circus, and I'm going to be the most famous imp ever, and I'll be able to do what I want to do all day. I'm going to make so much money and buy myself a big building with a big office. A big office? Yeah. Or a circus? It... Yeah. A it's not the circus office. part. Circus business with clowns and horses. And the horses will all have good names like Stapler and Biscuit Queen. <laughs> I'm sure you will. That sounds like a good business. Yeah, and if you apply, I'll hire you. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> You'll hire me? Yeah, if I feel like it. Well, I hope I qualify. <laughs> You'd oh. be a good boss. You say that with sarcasm. A hell of a boss. I totes would. <laughs> I'm like this is this is this is sweet right here. I like this. I like this. Uh oh. Dang, that was twenty five years. Back to the present. Stole this baby. <laughs> what is that? Still trying to get in. a big enough occasion but to be fair it's no picnic being married to a boring stiff like stolas oh that's the uh the one from the arranged marriage man she would have been got the boot what the hell no nah. what in hell is this Ugh, stolas you know i like throwing parties plus it's true so you can come if you want Nice. Stolas is terrible in bed. I swear to fuck, he just lays there staring at the wall, and I have to do everything. It's embarrassing. I'm glad one egg fell out of me so I could stop pretending to want to fuck his scorny <laughs> twig ass. <laughs> even if I was trash, even if I was garbage, at least keep that in the house, man. She gonna tell everybody that my stroke game is inadequate. Talking about my sex game is terrible. Goddamn, she don't gotta share with everybody. Bitch, what the hell? That's foul. Uh, what a pathetic fucking man. <laughs> Do you have anything stronger than this? Dirty. We have absinthe, your highness. Bring me all of it. That's a rat kebab? Uh. What, 
We got this nasty imp trying to sneak into your chambers. Them dogs actually what cool. What do with him? Into my chambers, really? Oh, well, that is concerning. Mm. Leave him to me. I will handle him accordingly. I like the security dogs. They're really cool. Follow me, imp. And bro went from innocent to evil. Look, I, I didn't mean to interrupt your whatever the party. I, I was just trying to. Don't bother with excuses. I know why you were here. You do. About put it on him. Yes, you were here to ravish me, weren't you? Uh. <laughs> you. Why else would you be breaking into my room? Yeah. You could have asked to visit, you know. It's been a long time, but I have a very good memory. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, you know, I figured, you know, since you're a prince and all, it might just be easier to you know, scale the walls and slip on in. It certainly is easier than going through your fucking staff. One would think. You might be here for nefarious reasons if you are sneaking in during the cover of night. Well, I wanted to crash the party, and it's always more fun, you know, to make an entrance. I recall how you enjoy making an entrance. So, over two decades since I last saw you, are you still a circus clown? Oh, <laughs> no, no. No, not anymore. No, I kill people now. Oh, <laughs> how afraid should I be? Well, I mean... How afraid do you want to be? Oh? Oh, well, um, well, I, uh, you know, I was teasing. I don't really. You, know, you seem pretty tense. How about I help you out there? Um, you know, this is, um, getting a wee bit. Is it hot? I'm starting to feel it getting very hot. This man, this man stole his pump faking. You got to shoot. He pump faking, bro. You don't want to tell him something. You're trying to come here for nefarious reasons. Sneaking in here in the in the in the night, you know what I'm saying? He the one that was putting the bussy on him. Now when the bussy getting put on him, he folded. He folded like a lawn chair. How do, how does that work, man? How you gonna try to entice somebody with le bussé, and then when somebody put that bussy on you, you start uh uh ooh, I, uh ooh, is it gonna hot here? Is it me? No, bro. Oh, what are you doing? I barely remember your name. It's Blitz. Oh, didn't it have an O at the end? Like a clown name? I remember. Oh. Yeah, well, it's silent now, okay? So call me Blitz. Okay. Blitz. Get that Blitz sussy. What do you want me to do to you? I, uh, well. Uh, ah, ah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, so forward, Blitz. Oh, what are we doing? No, no, stay down, damn it. Oh, so you like to command? You like being in charge, hmm? Yeah, I sure do. Oh, so you're a kinky little imp. Oh, so, okay, hello. Dirty. I want you to me with your in. Get it all the way. Yes, sir. Stop it. Yes, if that's what Blitzy wants. Blitzy, oh my yes. Oh, I've never had anyone want me this way. You have no idea how long I've craved this kind of passion and how much it means that the one who wants me is my first ever friend. Oh, all right, fine. Is he really about to leave? I can do this real fast. The morning after real fast. There we go. How you gonna try to leave with the butt when you got something more valuable in the bed? Stole his butt, bro. This, that, that butt was in the air like upward dog, man. A brother like me, as soon as he stole his throwing it up, I would have Shaquille O'Neal broke the rim, bro. Slam dunk, broke it, glass shattering, bro. I'm digging all in that. Saying he hit me with the, oh, Quimax daddy. Like, bro, it's over. Fuck your husband. What the fuck was that, Snorlax? That was the sound 
of a fucking divorce. There we go. <laughs> About time. So that must have been the first time they. It's fucking. Oh, the happy. Oh. I feel bad. Well, stop! It's annoying to hear you screeching your silly woes all the time. Why are you still here? You leave with fear on weekends, but then you stay around the house despite everything. I like tormenting you. I want to keep reminding you of what you did. I know what I did. I would feel would bad if I hurt you, but we both know I didn't do that. You and I were arranged for one reason, to birth a precautionary heir to the Goetia family. Nothing more. Yeah. I tried so many years to make it comfortable for us to have this family, but it was never enough. The only reason I have endured your constant insults and cruelty was for that girl to have a normal life. I cannot do this anymore. I want you out now. What do you mean? Out. I mean out, out the house, out the life, out everything. Of palace, out of my life. Yeah. We are getting the divorce. How dare you? What do you think the rest of the Goetia family will think? And drill for I don't care what your arrogant brother thinks. And the only thing the Goetia family wanted from our marriage is already 17, so it's over. I'm done. There we go. Fine. I have no desire to stay in the place of a traitorous embarrassment. You have fallen from what little grace you had, and I know you'll pay for it. Dang, she is a little bitch for real. <sighs> Nigga had to deal with that for years? Sheesh. Sheesh. All right, that's the circus season two, episode one. Right, this is a good episode. This is a really good episode. I like how they went uh, in the past just to show like the little build up of the relationships and stuff like that. Cause I was wondering why uh, Stolz was with, with with Stella, bro. She's a she's a she's a bitch. I ain't gonna lie. But as we looked in the past, it was it was an arranged marriage, bro. And he stayed for the sake of his daughter. I can respect that. I don't know if I had the the strength to do that, but I can respect that. So I can see why. He taking the happy pills every morning. Really, it seems like the only thing they get some satisfaction is uh, Blitz. Blitzy. Yeah, and it was interesting to see how everybody was just so nice. It's so innocent starting off. And now that they've grown older, they've they changed. For real, for real. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, you know what to do. Quaymax, aka Quay, aka your favorite imp. 